On this week's Boiler Tip, we're going to be talking about this sight indicator. Um, when people come to Boiler U, they love this. It's on our deaerator, and it is what we call an indirect level indicator. And the difference between a direct and indirect level indicator is basically we can see the water in a direct indicator. In an indirect indicator, we're just getting indication of where the water level is. So on this sight glass, it is easy to love. Uh, if we lower the level, we see the flags flipping and it's very clear where the level's at. And that is great because we can see this from 50 foot away or 100 yards away if it's lit up on a, on a dark day. And, and what's not to love? Um, the problem is it's good for a deaerator, it's not good for a boiler. On a boiler, we have to have direct indicators. We can have indirect indicators. They do make a style similar to this for boilers, but we still have to have a direct indicating sight glass and the range that we're allowed to indicate on a boiler is very limited. So this becomes impractical pretty quickly. If you want indirect indication on a boiler, um, you can use a method that we're also using on the deaerator, and that's a differential pressure transmitter. A DP transmitter is once again inferring where the level is. We're not seeing the water level directly, but this is giving us a signal that we can use for level control and it's not taking up a lot of real estate on the side of the boiler since we need to have a regular sight glass anyway. So two styles of indirect indicators that are useful, one probably a little bit better for a boiler than the other. <laughs>